Welcome everyone, welcome back to some more Final Fantasy 3 Pixel Remaster, my first playthrough of this version of the game. Uh, it's been a while, it's been a while since we've played this. Uh, say hi everyone in the Twitch chat to the YouTube folks. Um, we've done a little bit of grinding off screen, we're level 29 I think with everyone, yeah. Um, and I've kind of, uh, I think I've stuck with, I can't remember what jobs I had last time, but we've got, uh, Knight, White Mage, Dragoon, Dragoon, Black Belt, <clears throat> um, but yeah, not much else to report, really, uh, I think what we're supposed to do is, crap, oh, it was the underwater cave place, I think, I think that's what we were gonna do next, hey, Jim Topi, by the way, yeah, this was it, I'm pretty sure, because there was the other place that we found where I did do a little bit of grinding, but the monsters in there were actually pretty tough. I can't remember the name of it. We'll end up going back there anyway, but, um, yeah. Sorry I haven't managed to play this in... Gosh. I don't know. Has it been like two weeks? At least. At least two weeks. Feels like it's been forever. So. Hopefully the audio sounds okay. And, uh, we'll get cracking. I have to turn my headset up a little bit. I can't hear the lovely music. Yeah, there we go. It's really good, isn't it? <clears throat> There's some... Honestly, I know I keep saying it. Final Fantasy III has bomb-ass soundtracks. Sea Witches. Okay. Let's see if I remember how to play. Uh, jump. Yeah, why not? Kick. Actually... Let's just punch. Oh my lord. Okay, they still- Oh, we got 666 HP on Luneth. Oh, we did. Um, they are hitting quite hard still. But, um... I think- I think we should be okay level-wise. Because I, I did do a lot of grinding. Well, saying that, I think maybe I got two or three levels. But, uh, we're kicking out some damn good damage. Da, 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 da. K, K, sunken cave B2 Chest contains a diamond, a diamond shield Do I want to equip that on anyone? I'm kind of rocking the dual wielding swords with Luneth Let's just smack my desk, sorry uh, I don't think anyone else really Oh yeah, I'm dual wielding spears as well. It's so fr freaking cool that you can do that. I nearly said so fucking cool. It's a good job I didn't curse. Um, yeah, I don't think I'm going to bother with the diamond shield unless we really start to take... Ah, oh, sh should I just have... You know what? I am going to equip the diamond shield. Yeah, we're going to go for... We're going to go for a tanky tank. Right. Let's get lost in this cave, chaps. Ooh, a Aegeus. Jesus. Some scary looking mons in this game. <clears throat> uh, we got plenty of MP. Yet yeah, we're fully healed. Uh, we can use two Kiragas or Raises. It kind of sucks that Protect is a level 5 spell. I'm so used to that being, like, a really low level spell. Uh, the fact we can only cast it twice, and I don't think it actually... Yeah, you can only use it on one person, which, uh, kind of sucks. Oh well. But yeah, I love the black belt job. But boy, we are very squishy. Okay, regular cures actually do a pretty good amount of healing. That's as good. Nine nine nine. Holy crap, over a thousand with a jump. Holy balls. That's a lot of XP as well. We're definitely gonna be getting more levels. As well as job levels, of course. Um Right. Let's check the map. Cause that is such a cheap, cheap way of seeing where the chests are. Back in the day, I'd have to just walk down a, a corridor and hope to God it wasn't a dead end. 
Yay for mini maps and quality of life. Uh, ooh, Defender now. That's usually a really good sword, isn't it? It is. Oh, it is really good too. Problem is, I would lose. No, you know, you know what I'm gonna do. You know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna equip that. I'm gonna equip the blood sword back in the other hand because I just, I want, I want the HP recovery. It's so good. So that uh, diamond shield was uh, short lived. Indeed. Okay, uh, Kelpie and all the guys. It's all the guys. <laughs> Did I make that joke last time? I've just made it now. Cure yourself. Arc. Get jumping. Get punching. Oh, shit. Yeah, we still are so very squishy. And I'm pretty sure I've got my Dragoon on the back row as well. Good lord. This might still be pretty tough, you know. I'm thinking, uh... I think we might be in trouble. Well, actually... Oh, I love that. Ingus is just a boost. Boo -doo 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 -doo. Yep, we're gonna be. Wow, that was over 10,000 XP. Sweet, merciful mung beans. Yeah, I wish we weren't taking quite so much damage. That is worrying. Uh, welcome in, Ned. Right. Yeah, there's another chest down this way. Same again. Oh, why are we so slow? Ooh, look at those crits. Yeah, I, th I think the Blood Sword kind of mitigates the loss of defense by not having a shield, just with how much you can heal yourself. It's pretty good. Or do like it. Yeah, it's pretty, pretty quiet chat, isn't it? <laughs> I think I'm just being boring, to be fair. Unless people have gone and got food. I actually ate a curry live on stream before we started, and it was gorgeous, although... Ooh, got my temperature rising a little bit. Right, we got some level 30s. Good. I definitely need those levels still. Right, there better be something good in this chest. A dual tomahawk? What, 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 what? What on earth is that? That's probably for a viking, though. I bet that's for a viking. Yeah, I bet I can't use that. That's definitely a viking weapon, probably. Just makes me want to play at AC3. Preemptive strike. Okay, yeah, bloody hell. Heal yourself. Do 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 do. Not Valhalla. Well, I just think of the the tomahawks that you use in AC3. <clears throat> That's like his signature weapon in that game, isn't it? There we go. All right, we got some uh, fights. Yep, we got two people over a thousand HP. Very nice. Uh, welcome in, Ariel. Uh, just popping in real quick, but I hope the stream's going well. Cheers, yeah. No, it's, uh, we've only really just started. I've, I've been stuffing my face on cam with, with food. Um, and now we're finally getting into the game. So, it's all good, and, uh, wow, it's a lot of chests. A lot of enemies as well. But, uh, there's really no point me running from them, because pro we probably won't be able to run from them quickly. And, uh, we do. We need the levels. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 
As of time of recording, it's only 23 days until FF16. Oh my gosh. I could not be more excited. There we go, right, all level 30, beautiful. And, uh, Turtle Shell. Yeah, maybe I should use Turtle... Well, they're basically Protect, aren't they? I'll have to try and remember to use those in a boss fight. Ow! Oh my god, my na I think I just nearly... I think I cut myself with my nail. It's a really jagged bit of nail. Ow! Oh! Scratching myself. Alright, let's do... How many... Okay, we've got a few potions, I think. I've decided I will be the best uh, girlfriend ever and have uh, bought my BF Tears of the Kingdom. It's arriving tomorrow, so surely he will buy me a PS5 and FS16 in return, right? Insert that Anakin Padme uh, meme. Oh boy, I, I, uh, I'm I, sure he will love his present. I, I will pray that you will get a PS5 and FF16. Air knife. Diamond mail. Oh, I got a veteran treasure hunter trophy. Bloody hell. The chest contains a Loki harp. Diamond braces. There's a lot of chests in this room, uh, floor. Power braces. Diamond gloves. Elixir. Alright, let's see. Surely I can equip some of those. Diamond gloves. That's pretty darn amazing, actually. Then again... Yeah, I'm going to give that to... Yeah, get the diamond equipment on my knight. Uh, I sell I'm still good. Golem staff, rune braces. we give you the diamond braces instead. Yep. No better armor. Power braces. Yep, that's perfect. I wonder if I actually... I wonder. Could you equip the power braces? Oh, you could. That will give you more def Yeah, I'm going to give that to uh, my monk, actually. There's definitely a hidden passage over there. Yeah, I seize it. God, so much treasure. Diamond gloves sound hard to wear, though. They sound heavy. Monsters! Oh, no. Oh, right. I did encounter a zombie dragon off screen. In fact, I can't, I can't remember who did we fight one last time. Um, Yeah, they, they are pretty tough. Now, I think we could possibly kill it with heals. But I also, I'm not 100% sure. So we'll try it. I'm pretty sure we can. Let's boost. Oh, he hits hard. Ah. Wait a sec. Wait a second. The blood sword. Oh, the blood sword heals it. Right, we can't. Oh, bogger. Uh, bogger? Bogger. Right, let's guard instead. Um, that sucks. Let's do a cura. Punch it. This thing has a lot of HP. Oh, it did. I mean, it did. It's dead now. Uh, diamond gloves should be kind of light, but imagine the cuts. I don't know. Is diamond. I thought. Yeah, I guess diamond wouldn't actually be that heavy. I don't know. I've never had any diamond rings or anything like that, chap, so, uh. I'm afraid I can't comment, I suppose. I should just shut my mouth. Alright, there's gotta be. Oh, please tell me that all of these chests aren't monsters. Ooh! Eaters. Now, are these the enemies that. I think if you hit them physically. The, the, I fought some enemies off screen that killed me, actually. And they kept splitting. They kept calling for backup. And I think it was something to do with hitting them physically that caused that. I could be wrong. Um, 
Christoph, thank you so much for the sub. Diamonds are probably as heavy as stones. I mean, they are stones. If that makes sense. Um, let's see. Uh, I think I think these guys. I'm gonna guard. I think magic is okay. I'm gonna boost. I think the trick is to kill them in one hit. If you are gonna hit them physically. Because otherwise they do keep summoning other other monsters. And it just continues, and it's just hell. So we're gonna arrow you again. I'm gonna hope that we kill this other guy. Okay, that's good. Divide. Yeah, if you hit them physically, they divide. That sucks. Okay, so we need to kill them in... We need to weaken them with magic, and then kill them. So, let's do some curing of ourselves first. Jump. Uh, defend. Yeah, these are, these are pains. Oh, please don't kill me. Oh. Alright, let's get an arrow on you if we can. Although, saying that... Yeah, let's do that. Okay, we did enough damage with the Dragoon, that's fine. Right, so we should be able to kill you with another hit. Um, do I trust it? Guard with you. We really need to heal. Yeah, we won. We won. Okay. Oh, I hate fighting those. I hate fighting them. So much. A Triton Hammer. Ooh, again, that's probably a Viking weapon. I would imagine. So, are all these chests going to have monsters in them, but they give you items as well? Yeah, it is, isn't it? Oh, Death Claws. Oh my god. Fallout called it wants its monster back. Well, this was before uh, Fallout. Um, please don't tell me you guys divide as well. I have a feeling they might do. Hmm... Maybe, maybe not. Maybe not. We just hit pretty hard. That's fine. That's fine. Sweet. Da -da 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 -da. Yeah, we're nearly level thirty-one now. Ooh, s spellbreaker. Reflective mail. Ooh, now. Reflective mail. Is that... That's going to bounce spells back, isn't it? But is it also going to reflect... Healing spells? Possibly. But... If I put it on my knight, I can heal him with the blood sword anyway. We'll try it. We'll see how, we'll see how it works. If that's the case, I'm going to pop the diamond mail on my Dragoon. And give that a go. Monsters! Periton. Oh, shit. You look actually kind of cute. But I bet you're going to moider me. Let's, uh, let's boost. Holy crap, he just did, like, so much damage. Yeah. That's not cool. Oh, but the Dragoon, of course. Dragoon against Dragon. Checkmate. 
blood la Bloodlands. Oh, baby. That's totally going to be the blood sword, but a spear version. Dude. It was worth finding this route. It was worth finding these monsters. Fighting these monsters, I should say. Running a little bit low on uh, our basic spells. Alright, we need to go grab that other set of chests. Oh, ambushed, really? Do, 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 do. Good lord. Uh, just attack. I'm curious to see how this works. Oh, yeah, it does. I love me some blood weapons. Absolutely need them, though, because we are taking so much damage. Even with this new armor. Alrighty. Ooh, just another level for Leneth. Ancient Sword. Got a lot of new weapons. Ancient Sword isn't actually as good as what I've got. I mean, if I do wield it, yeah, it would be, but... Nah, I'm not, I'm not trading the Blood Sword. The Blood Sword is just too good. Too useful. Right, are these going to be more monsters? No, another Diamond Shield. Just full Diamond set in it. Ooh, Black Hole. And Bacchus' Soider. Now, doesn't that... Isn't that usually... Uh... Oh, that increases attack speed. Okay. Bacchus' Wine, I think, is usually like Berserk or something. Oh, well. Let's uh, sort my inventory, because it is a mess. Right. Uh, was this just a... Wait, this was just a treasure. I was thinking, yeah, there's actually nowhere else to go. Okay. Was this just to find... I'm, I'm trying to remember why we're down here. Aren't we trying to find the thing for... Uh... Uh, uh, Une or something? Oh, I just wish, wish I hadn't taken such a big break from it. Killer Hermits. Uh, hey! Hello to your kids, Zero Raven. ba da 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 ba da 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 There we go. Uh, let's see. Let's just go back to back up a floor. Yeah. Maybe this is just to. Huh. I don't see any secret pathways. Let me quickly check. Yeah, I don't see any other paths. Huh. Let's go let's go back up a floor then. Oh bloody back attack, no. Is FF3 the same jump from one to like how Dragon Quest 3 was a noticeable improvement from Dragon Quest 1 and 2? Uh, well, I've not played three Dragon Quest three yet, um, but I, I'd say three is a is a big improvement over one and two. Yeah, I, I definitely would say so. Well, I think that jump really comes with FF four. I'd say FF three is good, and there's definitely big improvements with like the leveling system, the, the implication of the job system. But I'd say FF four to me is where Final Fantasy really finds its feet. <clears throat> but that's my opinion. Uh, I kind of just want to run from this. I'm just gonna run. And bloody eight back attacks. Right. Yeah. Have we are we done with this place? Was it just to get those treasures, do you think? Hmm. 
Oh, I really wish there was a... I might have to I might have to look up a guide just to remember what Doga told me, because he buggered off to somewhere. Uh, I know Une is um sleeping. Oh boy. Yeah, I thought this was uh I think this might have just been treasure. Must have been. Still pretty good treasure. Uh I'm gonna be lazy, I'm gonna teleport. Even though I'm on the first floor of the cave. So there's other things we can find, though, in the submarine, I'm sure. But we're going to go heal up and then do some more exploring. Might quickly nip back to wherever Uno was. I actually don't remember. Um, Repleto? What the heck was Repleto? Okay, Uno, Doga's Mana, Uno's Shrine. Yeah. There's got to be other stuff. There's an island in the middle that I don't think we've been to. Repleto. It's all the way up north. Did I find that off screen? Hmm. Yeah, a little town here. I can't remember if we've, if we've been here in, in the actual videos. God, it's so hard to land where you want. Uh, made you see the claw under the island. There's a cave there. What? Repleto. Yeah, have we been here? I mean, there's an inn, so we'll stay at the inn. Hey, Random Dale, how's it going? Na, 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 na. Uh, Ubiquitous, hello! Yeah, I can't remember if we've been here. Could do it by... Oh, I've got, I've got quite a few high potions, actually. I've got so much money, though. But I might... Might need them. We'll buy a few more high potions. Got plenty of Phoenix Downs. Got an Otter Shroom, just in case. Yeah, I think we're alright for items, really. Da -da 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 uh, Great Mage Noah could command magic like no one alive today. Yeah, I'm just going to talk to uh, a bunch of people here because I can't remember. Barrier Shift doesn't work against summoning magic even if the enemy changes weakness to summon can still cause damage. That's good. I can't wait to unlock Bloody Summoner. Uh, so much chaos. My usual chaos seems calm now. How's everyone else? I'm doing all right. Let's get back to this game. Did I, uh... Da, 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 da. Oh! I did buy these. Yeah, these are summon spells, right. Yeah, we just don't have a bloody summoner yet. Yeah, we did come here. We must have done. <laughs> oh, yeah, because I remember the... Yeah, I remember the talk about now. Okay. Bum, ba -da -bum, bum, bum. This old dude in there. Can I get to him? I thought I could. Right, Leviathan and the Bahamut no longer inhabit these lines. Yeah, I know where Bahamut is. There's someone in that house. Ah! There's the... I could have sworn I tried going there, but okay. I'm Gulgan. In ancient times, the power of light flooded the world. Cataclysmic event. Now the same thing is happening with the power of darkness. Someone must be summoning it. Okay. Okay, that really didn't help me. Yeah, I might go chat to Une again. Yeah, I've been in here. Ah! That's what we just did. Right, okay, yeah, the... the uh, beneath the Triangle Island, right. So it wasn't really story-related. That's fine, then. 
So we've got that, um, there was that ancient ruins place that had a rock blocking the way. I wonder... I mean, try the, the hammer we picked up, isn't that just uh, a weapon, though? I wonder if I, I can use that to smash the rocks. I actually don't know. Key items. No, it's not a key item. Hmm. Do, 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 do. Right, let's leave. We've got some exploring to do. Yeah, there is um, a few interesting looking places. Yeah, I see there's a there's like a, a bay to the very south of this island. There's an island in the middle. Um, let's go check it out. A Seronia. Do love the music there. Right. Yeah, let's uh, see if there's anything below here. Aha! Is this the... Temple of Time! I vaguely remember them mentioning that now. Yeah. Nice one, Eli, for the uh, the catch on that. Right, let's go... Um, let's explore this then. We all, we're all healed. It's all good. Maybe I should... Well, it does also save, but I'm going to quickly go out and save anyway. Um. Bum bum, ba ba bum. Da 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 da. Right, let's go back down, shall we? Temple of Time. Alright, so we've got a few different rooms. We've got a flooded section. I mean, it is under under the sea, so it should all be flooded, really. A wyvern! Right, we know who to send against this thing. Yes, we do. Or, or we just slice it a bunch with our claws. That also works. Da, 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 da. The door's locked. Ah, we've got some keys. I don't know whereabouts they are, though, in my inventory. Magic key, you got seven of them. Is that a submersible blimp? It's a submersible airship. So pretty much, yeah. Another diamond helm. Okay, actually, you know what? Yeah, we'll, we'll give that. Give those to... Uh, Oh, physical fighters. Door is locked. Good job I bought all these keys, innit? Oh, crap. King Lizard and King Seahorse. I love those lizard guys. Oh, it absolutely is not the worst thing FF has done to the laws of physics. I mean, you, you, could you... Has there ever been a helicopter that can transform into, like, a, a submarine in real life? That would be so cool. Because, you know, you've basically already got a propeller. You just need to move it to, like, the rear of it. Make it kind of... You know? I don't know. Just make it watertight. <clears throat> I have no idea. I don't know how you get it back out of the uh, of the ocean, but um, they should work on that. They should make it. Sounds like something Q would invent, right? Diamond braces. Got enough of those, I think. But yeah, glad I picked up uh, all these magic keys. If it's heavy enough to sink, it's too heavy to fly? Uh, I don't know. 
I'm not an engineer. I'm sure there's some reason why it's not, like, a, a thing. Mm, Sky Captain had a plane that could fly underwater. Hey, Aldebaran. What's Sky Captain? Was that the Angelina Jolie movie? That movie. Yeah, I've never seen it. Well, I've seen bits of it, but I've never watched it all the way through. It just looked really weird. Sky Captain in the World of Tomorrow, wasn't it? Right, it's gotta be... Again, it bugs me that waterfalls hurt you in this game. What's all that about? I also bet there's nothing up here anyway. Bet there's nothing up here. No hidden items, nothing. Look, nothing. Wow, thanks, game. You liked it a lot? Oh, we got a Deera. Oh, Deera. Oh, dear, oh, Deera. Just hit it. Hit it lots. Oh, I don't think it likes wind. I think it's very weak to wind. Oh yeah, I mean, if you, I mean, I'm not talking like uh, a helicopter that could turn into a submarine and go down like really deep, but just like just under the surface. I don't know, it'd be kind of cool. Another defender. Right, a whole crap ton more doors. Well, let's go. Oh, and two staircases as well. I never watched Thunderbirds. I never really liked it. My dad loved it. He grew up watching Thunderbirds and Captain Scarlet. I, I don't know. I never got into it. I heard that Eternals film wasn't very good. That is a very good point, Zero Raven. That is a very good point. Hey, Becca! God, yeah, so many bloody doors need opening in this place. Really, I'm glad I bought those keys. Uh, chest contained diamond mail, yay. But yeah, I suppose if you're not going to be going too deep with it, then what's the point of making it a submarine if it's only going to be, like, really shallow? <laughs> what's the point? It'd be cool, though. Uh. You're a rocket scientist, that's fair enough. Diamond mail, that's some expensive postage. Oh, <laughs> You're an aviation mechanic in the Navy. Well, you would you would also know. <clears throat> I'm just dumb as shit. Just ignore me. Right, kill the wyvern. In fact, do I really need to jump? I could probably just slap it with my spears. I, I, the thing is, I don't think they're amateurs, uh, Eli. But apparently, they're, they're very knowledgeable. So I will take their word for it. I'm just a dreamer. That's all I am. Oh, that's... Oh, the staircase is letting me get to these doors, right. Let's go in this one first. All of them are locked. I'd be so pissed if I got here... Well, I hope I don't run out of keys. I'd be a pain in the ass having to go back and buy more. Oh, that's... Okay, that's going down. Maybe they both go to the same place? Maybe they do? Oh, 
Bonk, bonk, bonk. Oh, B3. Okay, this actually... Huh, there's definitely a treasure over there. Okay, I don't know how I get to that exactly. Oh, I see. Cracks on the wall, kind of give it away. Um, let me go back through the other door. Four of them, crap. Dee -dee 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 -dee. Ouch. Yeah, freaking what of our weapons I think it's uh I think it's Ark's weapon that can inflict stone. Which is pretty good. But the enemies, I tend to kill them before they turn to stone anyway. Well, you guys have uh, way more knowledge and, and expertise than me. I just play video games badly. Talk bollocks. That's all I do. Yep, I knew this one would be locked as well. Right, well, I'm, th I'm so glad I bought a bunch of keys. Diamond Gloves, Auricalcum, Auricalcum, which is actually a weapon that absorbs enemies HP as well, Jesus. Now it's probably good for like a thief, but I'm, I'm guessing I'm not really going to be using that. Can't equip it on now. That's fine though. <clears throat> So many fights. Ooh, Chimera Mage. Hey, it's a Chimera Me. Chimera Me. Sounds like a person's name. Alright, definitely heal yourself, please. What do you think you would have wanted to do, Mage, if not for YouTube Twitch? I, I wish I've... At various stages in my life, I've wanted to do a couple of things. Like, I wanted to make video games when I was really young. I wanted to... Uh, be a writer, um, but to be honest, I've never had a, a really strong conviction or uh, want to to do anything really. I don't know. I I find it very hard to get interested in stuff that would actually be useful in a job. Like I I was so bored of school. I wanted to get out of there as soon as I could. So further studying was just never really an option for me because it bore me to tears. And again, I didn't have a topic that I wanted to really... Oh, another trophy! That I wanted to really pursue. Um, no, no, it's fine. No, I'm, I'm, I'm glad for it because, uh, yeah, the stream's been pretty quiet, so I, I'm glad to have things to talk about. Uh, but yeah, I, I don't know. Um, I, th I think I've always been kind of wanting to go towards the creative side of things. Like, I couldn't have been a scientist or you know, any, anything practical like that. It'd have to be something creative. Um, but, honestly, I ended up doing the job that I did for 10 years because that was really the only thing I could do and it was decent money. Although eventually I just got sick of it and then I stumbled into doing this. So, I don't know. I'll let you know if I ever find out what I want to do. I mean, I want to do this, but realistically, I don't, I don't think this is really something I, I could ever do full-time and actually make a living on. I really, I'm going to have to get another job at some point. I just know it. Um, not because I don't enjoy this, but I just don't think I have what it takes. Right. Right door or left door? Oh, actually, no. I, want, I do want to go to that tre uh, treasure room. How do I find that? How do we get there? Go to the waterfalls, perhaps. <laughs> I 
You won't want to do that kind of stuff as a job. Yeah, I mean, that makes sense. You want to sometimes keep things that you enjoy as a hobby, so you don't have the pressure of doing them for a living. Jesus Christ. But my, my thing is, I just don't have any real talents in anything else that I'd be able to make a living out of. And the only other jobs I could do would be the kind of mundane office jobs where I'm just shuffling paper. And if I do have to go back to that, it'll be soul-destroying. But it's a very real possibility. Um, yeah. I don't know, I keep working at YouTube and streaming. Because I do enjoy it, but... A lot of days, I look, I look at the numbers and I go, Nah, I'm not cut out for this. Anyway, try, I'm trying not to be a... a, a down... a Debbie Downer. Go get this treasure. Like, I... I oh shit, a behemoth! Ooh! Crap! Also, I've got a bite on my leg. Uh, you're going to be scary, aren't you, mate? I'm going to boost for you. But yeah, I've never, never really been interested in any kind of profession. You know, like, uh, like my dad was always very hands-on, you know, he was a practical kind of guy, he loved Handy, handyman stuff, and I've got uncles that, you know, uh, have their own business with electronics, and um, I've got a couple of uncles that were plumbers, you know, stuff like that. I've just never, never been very good with my hands, so that kind of stuff was always out of the question. And I've never liked maths, so... That's a lot of just stuff out of the window as well. So, yeah, this this behemoth's hitting pretty hard. The only thing I've ever really had a passion for is is video games. And, and movies. Like, maybe I would have liked to have been a movie director, but I don't really know enough about that stuff. Something in food? Nah, I'm, I'm not a cook. I'm not, I'm not a cook. Cooking bores me to tears. Um, my problem is I'm just very... It's very hard. Once I get into something, I'm super into it, but... A lot of things just bore me. And it's really bad. Yeah, I mean, that's kind of how I've fallen into into this, purely because I left my job and I was really mentally low. Like, I couldn't have gone into another job straight away, so I decided to just give this a go until I got my head straight. And then, luckily, I've kind of managed to keep myself from going under. So, I just don't know how long that's going to last, but... Um, I appreciate you all. Every single one of you who watch my stuff helps me keep doing this. So, thank you. Um, yeah, well, I, again, I, I did want to write as a kid. And I have enjoyed writing, but... My problem is I'm very self-critical. And uh, I've written stuff in the past. Thought it was really good. Then re reread it, like, a few days later and gone, Oh my god, that is awful. And given up. I I also don't read enough, really. I do want to read more, and that is something I've started doing this year, but... I don't know. My writing is, is nowhere near the level it needs to be. Just purely because I just haven't done it much. But... But, yeah. I mean, I know that is definitely a thing. You know? They say just get it written, and then you can edit it later, but... Oh, man, I cringe. I cringe at some of the stuff I've written. Protect rings. Ooh. Protect rings. Excellent. God, they're amazing. Shit. 
shit. That's some good stuff. <laughs> You're not a showboat or a give me money now YouTuber. Well, the problem is, I think those kinds of people are generally more successful, and that kind of sucks. I see a lot of, um, a lot of, like, I wouldn't say big streamers, but bigger streamers than me. That, that have, like, a, 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 a stream goal. Every stream, like, they, they want so much money. And I'm like, holy crap, how, you know? And they're constantly like, hey guys, you know, it's been a slow stream, can you... If you can donate, that'd be really great. And I'm just like, oh, I couldn't do that. There's no way. So yeah, anyway, my, my point is, unfortunately, I've never really had an interest in an actual job. So... I'm kind of- I'm just- I'm just flubbing my, my way through life. Does anyone else feel like that? I genuinely just... I can't even see a future. You know what I mean? Like, every day I just have to take as it comes, because there is just... I can't even picture it at all. Not even in the slightest. Um, right. Right door. Wait, did I open the Yeah, I did open the left one. It's a good job I had all these keys, I swear to god. I've only got one left. That's the thing, the loot, of course. That's what we need to wake up Une. And we get some pterodactyls fighting us, okay. Well, I'm glad I'm not the only one. Just keep swimming, yeah. I just gotta hope that one day I'll I'll hit it big and won't have to worry so much about the money and stuff, but <clears throat> yeah. My my main thing that I'm grateful for is that I enjoy doing what I do a lot more now than when I was making good money. Well I was miserable every day going into work. So it's kind of I've swapped one for another and I would definitely prefer being happy over money. Because, uh, yeah. Thank you, Dale fan. That's very kind. Noah's lute, the mythical instrument lost to the flow of time, began to play a tender tune. I love this tune. Tender tunes. The opposite of banging tunes. That was lovely. Hey, right. Now we can definitely teleport the shit out of here. Okay, back to Une. We've made progress, yay! Yeah, lowest newt. Uh, no, low, lowest newt. Lowest newt was at the bottom of the sea. Lowest newt. God damn it! Da -da -da. Right, I'm just gonna heal up again at the end before we go. I'm not sure if there's going to be a boss or anything soon. I really don't remember. God, I need to be drinking more. Plays a Tangin Boon. I'd, I'd feel awkward sleeping next to the desk, right? Usually in these games, they have at least like a separate room or a little bit of a partition. Uh, before my third book, I had a job, half decent, but then my attendance got bad and there were days when I couldn't push the power button on my console. Oof. But um, now you're an author. I mean, damn, you've, you've actually... 
You've done at least three books? I am so jealous. That is really cool. Alright, I don't know why I'm talking to these people. I know where to go. I know where to go. Roughly. Where is Une's place of of uh, shrineness? Where was it? There we go. Pretty much directly south, mate. Do be do be do do. Let's do a quick save as well. Oh, love this tune. I've done eight books, damn! Too loot to publish? Ow! What kind of stuff do you write, uh, Dale fan? Right. I'm gonna play you a banging tune, uh, Une. It's gonna, it's gonna wake you right up. The sonorous uh, strumming of the lute reverberated around the room and passed into the world of dreams. It's lovely. Hmm? Her? Her? S squawk? Une's awake! Une's awake! Squawk! Yay! She's awake! Sci-fi! Okay. Oh, this is this music! That was a nice nap. Come here and sit on my shoulder, sweetie bird. Yes, ma'am! I'm still a bit stiff from such a long sleep. Gotta take, uh, shake off the cobwebs. Oh my god. Ah, the name's Zune, uh, Overseer of the World of Dreams at your service. Oh, another trophy. I've been asleep so long, I hardly know what to make of the world nowadays. Ain't that the truth? Oh my, the real world is impressive, don't you think? Eh, yeah, sh sure. But enough about that, Doga managed to reach me in my sleep and told me all about you and what Zande has done. First things first, we need to ship uh, a ship strong enough to transport us up and over mountain ranges. We should find what we're looking for in the ancient ruins to the north. Ah! Right then. Let's be off. You're coming with? What, are you embarrassed to go uh, on an adventure with a venerable old mage like me? No, no that's not what I... I thought not. Well then, shout. Yeah, let's just go. Une, join the party. Oh, I'm gonna miss this music. Oh, I almost forgot here. The Fang of Fire. What's this? It's another of the elemental fangs you've been collecting. With this, you should have three in total. Only with all four fangs can you hope to get past the statues Zande has guarding his tower. In order to find the final fang, the fang of Earth, you will need a formidable ship. Don't dawdle, okie dokie. You got the fire fang! Alrighty. I feel like we're getting close to the end of the game at this point, it's really weird. Um, right, so. Ancient ruins, which were above us, I think, I'm pretty sure. Uh, I'm, I'm guessing Une's going to have a way of getting past that rock that was blocking the way. Alright. It's one of these lakes, wasn't it? Is it? This one? Yeah, I always remember this area from the DS version with all the lakes and the mountains. Kind of a maze. Alright, I'm pretty sure this is where we want to go. Gonna backtrack near end game and clear the treasure chests off stream. Yeah, I probably do stuff like that off stream. 
I don't think anyone's too bothered about this playthrough anyway, so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna prolong it. Right, how are we gonna get through these rocks? Okay, Une's gonna do it. If I demolish an obstacle in the dream world, I'll get rid of the one in the real world too. Not even Adamantite stands a chance against me. Stand back now. Four. And again. Four. Nice. Ooh, these old bones aren't what they used to be. No time to waste, you four. The Invincible. Yes, the Invincible. Which, uh, obviously, I'd not played FF3 before I played FF9, so I just thought the Invincible was an FF9 thing. But no, it is a reference to FF3. I, that's why FF9 is so good. So many references. Alright, let's go. Now, ugh, really can't be bothered fighting these guys. They just keep splitting up. I'll fight everything else, but not those guys. I was kind of... I was really worrying then that it would be locked and I'd need more keys. More reflective mail, alright. Azrael. Now, are these the things that also split up? Let's try. I'm sure there was two monsters that kept, like, dividing. And it bugged the crap out of me. I ran away anyway. Whoops. I meant to defend with the other guys. Never mind. FF9 is the goat. Agreed. Oh, there's a freaking... Oh, there's inns and shops and stuff in here? Has to be some uh, grand discovery waiting in these ruins. I can feel it. How did you guys get past the rocks? Or maybe the rocks came from the earthquakes. That's probably what it was. Um, unscrupulous merchants keep breaking into the ancient ruins and stealing artifacts to sell, like weapons and armor. Gigantic ship, yes. Can you guys move out of my way, please? In and item shop. Alright, well this will be a pretty good place to grind then. Don't think I need anything from you. Let's rest up. With all this writing talk in the chat, maybe we need a writing channel in the Discord. Yeah, maybe we should. <clears throat> That'd be pretty cool. Oh, we can buy blood swords here, ancient swords, Medusa arrows, some blood lance. Don't need any of that, thanks. Again, guessing most of the stuff we've- Oh, white robe, I will take that. Yes, please be good. I mean, it is it is better than what we've got. Yeah, extra 11 defense, I'll take that. Way more magic defense. Do, 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 do. B2. Alright, looks like we got a bunch of rooms. Now, what's the bet in that some of these will have nothing in them? Then again, this is an FF2, so... Ah, Pyrolis. Now, we've definitely fought him before. He gives a ton of XP. But he is also quite tough. Although, we are stronger now. We've gained a few levels. That blood sword. Oh wow, yeah, we're definitely stronger than we were. That's good. And Ark leveled up, level 32. Let's start from the bottom and work our way up. Ah, same again. Okay, okay. Do, 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 do. 
Oh, we're turning it to stone as well. He's dead anyway. I think uh, Ark's like level 64 job level now. A black belt gee. Gee whiz. Haven't we already got that? Yeah, we've already got that equipped. Unless it's... Hmm. Yeah, no, I think that's... Okay. Allow me a harp. Yeah, we've already... It says we've got one. Anyway. Major Renault fanfic channel, get out. If anyone writes that, they will be banned. Oh, eaters, you can suck my left nut. I don't want to fight you right now. Look, they're multiplying. They don't even need to be hit. They're just doing it. No. Absolutely bugger off. Screw that. Chakra band. I think we've got all this stuff. Isn't that what I've got equipped? Yeah, it is. Nope. See you later. Being super lazy. Just not fighting anything. At least it's fairly... I don't want to jinx it, actually. I'm not going to say it. I was going to say, oh, it's easy to run away. Don't even go there, mage. Don't even do it. Rune Bell, that's for... Yeah, there's Geomancer in this. And I think I did test it out off screen. It's not that amazing. I do like using them in FF5 though. But I don't think I'm going to be swapping to a, a Rune. Uh, a Geomancer. Because they use, you know, terrain abilities. Some of them can be pretty cool depending on where you are. I, I did like them in 5. It's cool because they don't use any MP. Da -da. Fairy claws. Yeah, I'm 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 happy with the claws right now. Uh no, we've not unlocked all the jobs yet. I still haven't... I don't think I've found any equipment that the Dark Knight can use, and I'm really wondering why, because it, it looks like it can use swords. But maybe it's only a specific type of sword? I really like the Dark Knight. I can't bloody use it. Oh. Okay, those are new. Okay, not too tough. Mind the gap. Oh, they can divide as well? Why can all the enemies in this fucking place divide? Oh, it does me tits in. Bloody hate it. Oh my god. Sons of bitches. Well if I boost they won't they won't get a chance. Nice. Yeah, crap XP as well. Those enemies that divide, they always give crap XP. B4. Oh, I clicked auto by accident. Oh, shit. 
I think I'm just going to run from these guys. Although, saying that, I have boosted now, so maybe we should just kick them. Yeah, just kick them. Nice. Yeah, they probably do expect you to fight a lot more of them. Yeah. Because if they, if they all gave really good XP, the fact that they keep spawning more of them in a fight, it would make it too easy to grind, so I, I understand why. It's just annoying. Nope, not even once. Not even once. B5. Jesus, this is a really deep ancient ruin. Just really want to get the Invincible. The Invincible is so good. I also love the music for it. I prefer it to FF9's Invincible. B6. Christ, it keeps going. No, leave me alone. B7, I think this might be it. Or getting close. Here we go. Love the music. Ugh. Which is actually just the um it's the mountain climbing thing, but still. Ugh, it's so good. Right, uh, I think there's... Yeah, I was gonna say, the smell of chocobo's there. You get your own fat chocobo on the, on the airship, you get your own bed. Which is awesome. Yeah, thankfully, we don't have to fight the invincible to tame it. Um, what else is there around here? Oh, we got freaking shops. I don't remember there being shops on here. Demon shield. Damn! De Demon mail's gotta be for the Dark Knight. Right, it is, isn't it? Ashura, that's the Dark Knight sword, it's gotta be. Right, so we might get a Dark Knight on the team. I just don't know who I would replace. Because I like the Knight. Hmm. Hmm, this is tough. This is tough. I might... Well, we'll buy the Ashura. We'll buy the Dark Knight stuff. Uh, cheers, Kitgath. You look away. I'm gonna get all the Dark Knight gear. I think that's about all I can get. And we'll give, uh, we'll give the Dark Knight a go. There we go. Can I really not equip any accessories? That kind of sucks. Yeah, so stats-wise, obviously we're back at job level one, which isn't gonna be great, but I just wanna I just wanna see how the Dark Knight is. We probably will end up swapping back to the knight. But I just love I love the Dark Knight so much. Um Right. What magic can I buy? Kiraja. Ooh, now I don't have that much money left. Quake, Brick, uh, Drain. Now, until we get more level 7 spells, there's no point me buying these anyway. But uh, it's nice to know we can get them. Right. Should we take off? Time to set sail. You take the helm. This is your ship now. Look at it, it's so big. This is the music I was thinking of. This is the invincible music. It's 
so good. I'll give you a guided tour of the ship. Um, use the ladder when you want to disembark. When you want to come back aboard, stand directly below the ship and press the confirm button. Uh, press the confirm button to redline the engines so the ship can clear small mountains when you fly at them. Right. I already know. <laughs> yeah, fat chocobo. Oh, he appeared. <laughs> He's really squeezed in there. That is a small little area for him. Rest up on the bed. Leaving already? That's right. I trust you can handle what lies ahead. What matters now is that you obtain the Fang of Earth. It rests in the Cave of Shadows, north of Emu. Alright. Return to Doga's Manor. Okay. We must remember this. They've told me exactly what to do. If I don't end up playing this for another bloody... Although we should be playing this again on Friday. So, if I forget, then it's my fault. Excellent. Oh, I only left the party. It was short but sweet. Look, we got freaking cannons on this thing. I wish I could use them. D D. I mean, we're still going to be gone for a little bit yet, anyway. Um, so, yeah. North of Amu. Let's go. Look how big it is compared to the other ship. How do I do this again? Boost. There we go. Okay. Not quite. I mean, it'd be easier if we could just fly over them constantly, but okay. Only boost over them in certain areas. Uh, where is Amu? I just forget. I think it's on the other continent, isn't it? D D D D. Yeah, it is. Southeast. Nearly there. Yeah, how the heck am I going to land this thing? <laughs> View! Right, so wait, I don't know why I've landed. It says to the north of Amur, not at Amur, so... Um, but we'll use this opportunity just to see how the Dark Knight fares. I mean, the enemies around here are going to be pretty weak anyway. Um, I forgot we got our canoe. And then again. I don't remember fighting these things around here. These might be quite rare. Don't know. Yeah, it kind of just lands in place and you kind of just drop down. Probably a rope ladder or something. Yeah, our Dark Knight needs some levels. So, we'll see. We'll see how it goes, but I'm I'm probably going to end up swapping back to Knight. Uh, mm -hmm. I'm also her personal copy machine operator. Oh dear. Right. Yeah, Dark Knights get uh, quite a bit of HP, though. This is a banging tune. Um, yeah, we did the Temple of Time, Jim. Yeah, we did that. So uh, we've got the Invincible now. And it's going to be somewhere. Somewhere. That we have to jump over some mountains to get to. It's over that way. North of a moor. There's a cave there. Ah, I think that's it. That's probably. Oh, we could get we could get there. No, that's not the cave. Oh, it is just to the north, right? 
Can we can I boost? Can I boost? Oh, we can only go over so... Oh, I think I know how it works. It's only a small stream of mountains. Yeah. Stream of mountains? Uh, freaking... What's the what's the word? Not peak. Um, range, range of mountains. That's the yeah, Dexter. I got it. We got it. Is it even further north of a mo Oh, it must be one of these ones. Yeah, it is. Look at this. We're just gonna have to leapfrog over these mountain ranges. There we go. I've gone the wrong way. Oh no, no, this this must be right. Oh, maybe not. Uh, well, that's I that's where I need to go. That cave up there. I think I have to go up. Can't get that way. Oh, we can fight things on the invincible. The artillery is actually used. I forgot about this! Holy crap, that's so cool! Blade Blitz, that's gonna be our Dark Knight attack, isn't it? That's probably gonna use up some of my HP. That's so awesome. I didn't I didn't remember the cannons actually were used. That's so cool. Oh, they're dead anyway. I forgot you could fight things on the Invincible. Oh, frick. How the heck do I get there? Uh, is there a better way of going about this? Maybe further up the top? No. There must be a specific route you have to take. Oh, wait. Boost? Oh, I can boost that way. I don't want to boost that way. God damn it. I'm guessing you have to do it absolutely perfectly. Yeah, you got you got to start here. Can you not boost diagonally? Yeah, this bit's... We'll figure it out. Oh, three of them. Yes, artillery! Don't know how the artillery's actually hitting clouds, though. It's like hitting the clouds and exploding. Blade Blitz. Hey, you still welcome in. All right, we must have to go south, then up. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this is right. Why did I get stuck here last time? It's super easy. It's super easy. I didn't use HP, did it not? Interesting. Maybe that was only introduced in 4. Uh, which way do I want to go here? Frost flies. I'm going to have everyone else defend. I just want to see how this works. Yeah, that didn't use HP. Didn't do a lot of damage, but... Okay. Hippity hoppity this ship, no stoppity. You said it, pal. I feel like that's a, that's the wrong way. Uh, I'm gonna guess it's this one. Nope, it's not that one, it's the middle one! Perfect. Oh, so close. 
Simurg. The damage we're kicking out with that wind spear. These flying critters don't stand a chance. Alright, we made it. Oh yeah, which I guess it means we can kind of technically land anywhere, because uh, we're just hovering above the trees. Right, cool. Let's have a quick kip in the bed. Do, 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 do. Uh, can you save on the ship? I'm not sure. I'm just going to save here. Cave of Shadows. Oh, look, there's a fellow Dark Knight there. I've come here from Falgabard to further my training. Where the fuck is Falgabard? Be careful of the monsters in this cave. They multiply when attacked with normal swords. Oh, that's why... Oh, I bet the Dark Knight sword doesn't do that. It's telling me to use a team of Dark Knights now, isn't it? Ah, so I'm actually kind of glad I did swap over. I can still use my Dragoon fine. We might be okay. As long as we don't use regular swords, maybe? Okay. Oh, it's definitely a uh, treasure room that way. Lamia scale? What does that do? Inflicts confusion. Yep, so... Oh, and Valfor! You look a bit different. So I think we're going to be relying on uh, Blade Blitz and boosting and kicking. God, they're in hard. I'm trying not to sneeze. Oh, no. <laughs> they still divided. Okay, so we just can't really hit them physically unless you're doing a, a Dark Knight ability. Or um, maybe even a kick would work. Thank you. Bless me. Ugh. Oh no, kicking causes dividing too. Oh no. No. Stop it. Jesus Christ, we're running. We're running from this fight. We are running from this fight. If it'll give me chance. Please let me run. Please. Thank you. Right, so note to self. I mean, I don't, I don't want to make a team full of Dark Knights. Plus, it will be expensive buying all the equipment. But, uh... Phew. You do get more XP if they divide, yeah, but... I don't think it's worth it, really. Hey, passive! Yeah, this place could be pretty rough, I reckon. Yeah, a bunch of Dark Knights just chilling here. Now, jumping, that's probably going to kill them in one shot anyway, so that's fine. Ugh. Jesus. Yeah, we're still taking a lot of damage. Like, a lot of damage. Might need to level up my Dark Knight a little bit.
Yeah, if you can if you can one shot them, they don't get a chance. Oh no, Lunith has died. Bloody hell. Well, I do have rays. Oh shit, boost doesn't work over multiple ball sacks. <laughs> boost doesn't work over multiple ball sacks, that's what I just said. Uh, yeah, this is... This is not cool. I knew you were gonna go for bloody Lunath. Oh. I'm just gonna use the Phoenix down. Screw it. Okay. Do 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 ba da ba do ba ba do ba do do. Do do. All right, we won that fight somehow. Yeah, it's not worth the XP, man. They're really not. At least one has gained level two. There we go. More backer Soider. Sir, are you all right? I thought I had mastered the Dark Blade. I was wrong. But perhaps it was fate that brought us together. Here, take this sword. A Kotetsu. Oh. Okay. Ooh, that's actually not that better. I'll take it. I mean, it is better. I mean, we could do a wield now. Ooh, we could do a wield now. I've got crap defense anyway. You know what? I'm going to do a wield. Yeah, we're doing it. We're doing it. But I think um, I'm going to head back out and, and heal and save again. Now that we've got the treasure and stuff. This place could be a bit of a nightmare. I might end up just running for most of the fights, to be honest. Yeah. Might do. If it's going to be the same ones over and over. Well, let's see how much more damage we do now. Not that much more, but the fact that they don't divide when we hit them with that is definitely worth it. God, they hit so hard, though. Hirosan, thank you for the sub. I beat FF3 and FF5 last weekend. Damn! You work quick. Don't kill... Oh, for God's sake. He's trying to get me attack off. Yeah, this cave sucks. I hate this cave. I hate it here. Bloody hell. Go for an arrow. Okay. Yeah, this place is officially gonna suck bowels. Alright, let's leave. Get back in our shippity ship. Oh, it's so great having a free heal here. Although, saying that, I bet it won't revive, will it? No, it probably won't, so I need to do that manually. I can buy more Phoenix Downs here, though. I do have magic. Oh, it will revive? Oh, okay. Because in other places, you have to use the revive stuff. Like the... Weird fountains. Right. Uh, yeah, I think, uh, I think we might just call it there, chaps, and then attempt this place properly next time. I reckon. We'll be back on Friday. And, uh... We can't save while we're on the airship. That's a shame. But that's okay. I can save now. But yeah, cheers uh, everyone for watching. 